Hey, it's Nathan Williams with Careers at Marketing, and today I'm gonna to show you how to quickly create a squeeze page using ClickFunnels. Now, ClickFunnels is a tool. It's like an all-in-one tool, has a page builder, lets you take payments, has automations, has affiliate programs, and other systems. So you could essentially run your entire business from ClickFunnels. Now, with what we're gonna do, it's gonna be pretty simple. Two-page squeeze page, the squeeze page, and then the thank you page, and we can connect it to our automation tool or our autoresponder tool, and I'll show you all that. So we're just gonna do this real quick. I'll show you how easy it is because I've seen some people are still having trouble setting up a squeeze page, and that should not be what holds you back from you know driving leads and starting to grow your business. Should not be a page, right? They're so easy to create, especially with tools like ClickFunnels. And one last thing, if you do decide to get ClickFunnels, if you go through the link below this video and send me your your welcome email to support at crazymarketing.com, I'll give you access to a ClickFunnels training course. I'll teach you everything you need to know about ClickFunnels. So yeah, so if you wanna learn how to build funnels and do all the other cool stuff, that course will show you that. This course, or this video, is just about a squeeze page. So let's get straight into it. So here I am inside my ClickFunnels dashboard. I'm gonna to go to add new at the top here and I'm gonna create a new funnel and I'm gonna choose this, click emails, and I'll just do demo, squeeze, page. I could go ahead and group it, so keep my funnels organized, but I'm just gonna ignore that for now and it'll land wherever it lands. Hit that build funnel button and we'll give it a few minutes here, or hopefully a few seconds. And then you'll see that ClickFunnels automatically sets up the page types that we're gonna need for our squeeze page funnel. We got opt-in page, a thank you page over here. And then on the right-hand side, in this area, we go ahead and pick the page templates that we wanna use, or we could build one from scratch. The choice is yours. Uh, so we got opt-in, email opt-in, and it's pre-selected. And then we can just scroll through all these templates here. ClickFunnels just added like 100 new templates, if not more. So there's a ton of beautiful, nice looking templates you can choose from. Or again, you can build from scratch or you can grab one of these, customize it to suit your needs, etc. So like, we'll take a quick look, preview this one. So this one looks cool. I like this one, that one's nice. Or come over here, this one, preview it real quick, see if we like it. Yeah, that one looks nice too. So I'll go ahead, hit select template and it goes ahead and installs it on my page right here. I can hit this edit page button then. And it pops up the page builder. And this is a drag and drop page builder, so it's really easy to use. It operates based off of sections, rows, columns, and elements. So sections are the big part of the page. And then inside of sections, you have rows. And then inside of rows, you have columns. And then inside of columns, you have different elements. And elements are things like headlines, subheadlines, bulleted lists, images, videos, buttons, inputs, so text inputs, and so on. So that's how you design your page. You can drag and drop whatever you want, wherever you want. It's real easy to use, user-friendly. And again, if you go through the link below this video, I'll give you access to my ClickFunnels course. And uh, yeah, you'll learn how to use it appropriately. So say you got this page, you can go in here and you know, customize it, get my guide free, or whatever it is, and, you know, customize it how you need. And we'll hit save now, and name it demo squeeze page. Cool, good enough, save. And then we'll back out of here. So my squeeze page is done. Yeah, I didn't customize it or anything, so it's gonna take a few more minutes to customize it, switch out the images, the wording, the colors, and things of that nature, but very easy to do, drag and drop. Come down to the thank you page then, and we gotta go ahead and pick out a thank you page to use. Or, of course, you can select or build one from scratch, so fully customizable. And we'll wait a second for it to load. So here we go, so make sure we're on the right area, so opt-in, thank you. And real quick, just to give you a short tour of the different pages. So we got sales pages. So we got sales page, product launch pages, order form pages, one click upsell, one click downsell, order confirmation. So there's a bunch of different page types inside of ClickFunnels depending on what you're trying to do. And they all have different settings and functions and things of that nature, but it lets you build, you know, pages, funnels, evergreen webinars, 
like everything. You can run your whole business out of ClickFunnels. Very powerful tool. All right, so thank you, Paige, now. So let's see, go on through here. Again, they have like 100 templates we could go ahead and choose from uh, for our thank you page. Like, do, do, do. So I'm gonna try and pick one that looks close or that fits with the page that I pre, my squeeze page, which is it this one right here? And we'll go with this one, close enough. Again, we could go ahead and customize the colors and make it match however we want, so it's not that big of a deal. Go to edit page, and we'll just take a look at it real quick. So here we go, there's my thank you page. These pages all look good on mobile, so you can see what it looks like on mobile. You could also adjust different elements on on how they appear on mobile, so like my headline. So if I want this to actually be on one line instead of two lines, I can just come over to edit mobile size, shrink it down, let's try 32 pixels, and boom, just like that. It's looking good on mobile. We hit save, and I could go ahead and link this button to download my product if I wanted to. So if I had a lead magnet PDF or something like that, I could go ahead and connect it. And ClickFunnels does host files for you. If you come under digital assets here, you can upload a file up to three megabytes. So smaller files can be hosted on ClickFunnels. Alternatively, you could just host a file on Google Drive or Dropbox and just link to a shared file. Uh, that way, that's that's how I do it always, is I just have my files on Dropbox and people can download it straight from there. So, But if you do have a smaller file under three megabytes, you could host it on ClickFunnels. So they do have that option. Now let's go ahead and connect our autoresponder tool, show you how that feature works. Uh, but before I do that, let me go to integrations real quick and show you the tools that ClickFunnels integrates with like out of the box. I do add new integration here. And so here's all the tools that ClickFunnels integrates with. So Actionetics, ActiveCampaign, which is what I use, Aweber, Constant Contact, ConvertKit, Drip, EverWebinar, Facebook, GetResponse, and the list continues. I'll go kind of slowly through here. So if you wanted to pause the video or something like that and see if your tool integrates with ClickFunnels, then you could do that. I also want to point out that ClickFunnels integrates with Zapier. I'm not seeing it right here, but it integrates with Zapier, which integrates with over 900 other tools. So if you don't see your tool listed right here, you could integrate it more than likely with Zapier and make everything function. Also, you can import HTML forms. So if your autoresponder tool lets you create an HTML form, you could plug that into ClickFunnels and ClickFunnels could like, like sense the fields and connect the fields and the data and all that type of stuff. So between these native integrations, Zapier and HTML forms, like you're gonna be able to integrate your automation tool with ClickFunnels, uh, I'm pretty, pretty dang sure. You can Google it as well. I'm sure somebody has done it uh, if you have any questions or issues. Or you can ask below, I'll, I'll try and help you out as well. All right, so anyway, I'll show you how easy it is to connect your automation tool to your squeeze page. So we'll open that back up, go to settings here, integrations, and we'll go to our integration, find whichever autoresponder tool you want to integrate with. I chose my active campaign account, select integration, so I can add to list, add to list with tag, delete from list, remove tag. So I do like add to list with tag, and then I select my list, and then I do my tag, demo lead magnet, or whatever tag, or however I want to trigger my automation. And I just hit save, and back out of here. And then I can go to this link right here or up here as well. Uh, you can also customize your links. I'm just using the default ClickFunnels link, but you can have custom domains, subdomains. ClickFunnels will even give you a free domain for a year. Uh, so yeah, you don't have to use the ClickFunnels domains if you don't want to. But here's my page live on the internet now. I could go ahead and opt in real quick. Send me it now, send me it to now. I think there's a typo on that thing. Anyway, and it brought me to my thank you page and I could go ahead and follow the button here to download my file or join my Facebook group or whatever it is. And you see, just like that, within 10 minutes, I put together the squeeze page and the thank you page 
yes, I did not en edit any content or anything like that, but I showed you it's drag and drop, easy to do, uh, should not cause you any pain or anything like that. And I also integrated with my automation tool, which is Active Campaign. So that's how you can go ahead and create a hot, uh, beautiful looking high converting squeeze page very, very quickly. Uh, and again, if you want ClickFunnels and you go through my link below this video and forward your welcome email to support at crazymarketing.com, I'll give you access to my ClickFunnels course, which teaches you everything you need to know about ClickFunnels. So how to build funnels and automations and things of that nature. So, and the reason I'm doing that is because I earn a commission for referring people to ClickFunnels. So it's kind of like a win-win situation. You don't pay anything extra by going through my link and, and but I earn a commission and I kind of pass that on to you by giving you access to my ClickFunnels course. So anyway, that's it for this video. Just wanted to show you how easy it is to create a beautiful squeeze page and yeah. All right, take it easy.